Hey everybody, Road Warrior Max, Robobus, and we have a very special video today. Guess where we went today? We went to PowerCon 2022 He-Man yes. Convention. <laughs> we drove and we did it. We drove downtown real quick. Yeah, and we're gonna do a pick. Oh, you're gonna, yep. Okay. We and got some. This is our pickup cool video, stuff. and we got some really cool stuff. We're really excited. Okay, um, we're gonna open these three. Well, let's start. Let's just uh, go quick. Yeah. Pixel Dan was there, so we had to get his book. He is so nice. R yes. He is really nice. And he sold a lot of these, so... He said to Cole and Sean uh, from Pixel Dan. Yep, so we picked up Pixel Dan's book, which we were looking at, which is really, really cool. cool. Oh my god, it has, has all um, the vintage toys, all the way up to Super 7 in there. This is a great book. A must have if you're a He-Man collector like us. And I'm coming down. Oh, we got a pin by Dan Larson was there. Dan Larson. Toy Galaxy. We bought a pin off him. I, th I think it's uh, it's probably, it looks like Skeletor, but very, I'm not it, sure. The space Skeletor, maybe. Yeah. I, but I he was really nice, and we got a surprise with Dan Larson and Pixel Dan. Yeah. But we're gonna show you guys in a minute here. And look, he, there's his his kids pass, and we picked up some Super Seven He Man's. There was a lot of vintage stuff there. I kind of, kind of disappointed because there was not a lot of just vintage, no, origins. We didn't see a lot of origins. No. They had uh, Wonder Bread He-Man. Yeah. They wanted $5,000 for it. They had attorney of play sets in the box. Some of them were, it was crazy prices. Yeah. A lot of $5,000 figures and stuff, eh? Yeah. We've seen some rare figures. We've seen the Argentina vintage He-Man ones. Okay, we're gonna go. we picked up uh, Shadow Ur Orco. And he's pretty cool, actually. Yeah, these were decent price too, and we got the clamshell case. And we got we didn't pay this for it. No. Nope. And here we got you know, all the Super Seven figures. Yep. And I'll go with our other He Man's we have. Yes. Yeah. I was thinking, you know, uh, we could put him behind Castle Grayskull, oh, okay. and it'd be like he trying to sneak in, but Orko stops him. That's a good idea. Yep. And we have Evil Seed. Oh, we, I've been watching I him for a while. I love Evil Seed. I know. He's so cool. We were thinking about getting a, a little castle for him, like small little vines and stuff for him, and like trees around him. Then we got the background. I love this artwork. I love how it shows what you can do with the figure. It's got the, all the Super 7 figures, you know. One day we'll get all of them. First, we only, ha we only have a couple of them. Yeah, we have a few now. Yeah. We have yep. We have the Shira one is... We have two He-Mans, yep. and we have, that might be it, huh? I guess so, yeah. Three, now we got five. And we got Evil C, that, that's a good one. Yeah, and, and then course, we got Cole, Behind Again. Robobus, has, he's been wanting a new WWE figure for a while. I kind of wanted, and they had a lot I wanted to get Rowdy Ready Piper, but I just picked him because, you know, why not? He comes he's with cool. cool weapons, and Stone yeah. Cold Steve Austin, so he's got a new WWE. And a new comic. Yep. Um... I forgot to tell you about the comments. There's comments each in one of these. Okay, so I love it how that you can take this off. You can switch the hands. I love the artwork and everything about it. It's so cool. Got the other figures. I'm guessing he's like trap jaw. Yeah, definitely. He has a jaw. Okay. Yep, he's gonna be cool with our other wrestlers. He's the exact same. Okay. And for Gray, we picked up a gift. We have. He collects pops, and pop he loves Star Wars. We got Specifically, him. so we picked this guy up for him. We got Bubba Fett, and I got the robot lady. I don't know her name. Yep, we picked that up. It says a gift. Bubba Fett and Angel are on throne. throne. That's a really cool fit pop figure. There's the back. Yep, and there's the back. Got all the he might have a couple of them other guys, too. I think he has... I um, think I got him one, too. This one? Yep. That one. And he got a couple more. But this is gonna be. He's, he's gonna like this yeah, one. Yeah, he's gonna. I'm gonna open this at the end. Robobus got some Pokemon there. Some guy was selling Pokemon. Robobus got his first graded Pokemon. You know, you know funny? This guy's named Rose. We just. I just got a new puppy, and her name is Rose. Yeah. And it's a um, it's a graded mint nine. nine. So it's that, pretty good it's really grade. Cool. It's what right for twenty bucks. Yeah, we got a good price on twenty bucks. Robobus is so happy about his Pokemon. He made me go back. He got a good, a really good deal on that stuff. Mm -hmm. Next we got. Oh, then we got uh, the uh, the PowerCon. Oh wait, back. 
Oh, we're gonna go. Oh, oh come yeah. on. And we just got regular things. That's great. A 9.0. Look at that. Pretty cool. That's a mint. I'm gonna have a And here's on the other our, side. one of our. We picked up a, a real. Well, we'll show the. Okay, well, there's a power con. Um, just like the magazine that it comes. Like the. Whatever they call that thing. Uh, stuff right. about it. I forget it. what they call it. It's called something. Then we have this. Look at this. I got. A we, guy, we, we got, there was a vendor there selling just the Castle Grey Skull box. Do you know how much this was? 50 bucks. We paid $50 that for the empty box. Yep. Cheap. We thought that was a good price. And then as we were walking, Robobus actually had a good idea. Me and him said, let's go see if Dan Lars and Pixel Dan will sign our He-Man box. Mm -hmm. So he signed that. So look at This is signed by Dan Larson. They then Pixel Dan or Dan Pixel Austin gave Dan. us a really good idea. Yep, they both gave us a good idea. They said, Ruby, Rudy Oberall, the guy that did the artwork for this box here, he was right at the booth right next to it, and we brought it over, and he pointed at me as soon as I walked over, and he signed it right there. He, Rudy. We tried to give him... And I tried to give him a little bit of money, and he wouldn't take it. He's so nice. Th these guys are all really nice. Pixel Dan, these... Guys are like really nice people, really nice. Oh, the whole community. Yes, so look at this nice. Castle Grey Skull box I have with the autographs. So it's been a little bit of a war. It's a little beat up, but for the price, uh, I I don't even care. It looks good. Yeah. <laughs> the front looks good. But the back is a little torn. And that's the but only part that matters is the front. Good, though. It still looks good though. So now I have my original Castle Grey Skull when I was a kid. So now I have the box for it, and I have the instructions. Okay, so. you know what? Something's really, really bad. We, okay, I saw a uh, I saw the box of a um, ca uh, Snake Mountain. I saw the box of Snake Mountain. So when we dropped this off in the car, we went back and we went to go um, see it. And there, it, it was not just the box. They had the stuff sealed in there. You're right. But they wanted two thousand five hundred dollars. I know. Is that crazy? Just for that. And the box was kind of beat up. Remember? Yeah, it was. It was so yeah, good. so that's what we're saying about some of the prices were high. Twenty five hundred dollars for a just a sealed Snake Mountain. That has all that, the That's stuff, though. crazy. But still. It's still a lot of money. We anyway. paid fifty dollars for the box. Got a hole right here, but this is the part that matters. Okay, yo, something's funny happened. We're gonna flip it over and show it again. The guy who was selling this, we offered him fifty. You know what he said? Sold. <laughs> he Quick, said, Sold. I should have done like forty, that. right? But just still. Like that. And we didn't pay nothing for the autographs. Nope. No. No. Nope. This everyone signed that for free. It's Isn't so that cool. cool. Like, look, it feels so cool. And we're going to have to find some, a real nice this shelf is, space for it. This is my new best friend. My and Robobus is really excited about it. We're as gonna, I am. We're going to put it on the shelf? Yep. Oh, good catch call. Look at our pickups. We did super good. Yeah. The book. We came, we knew we were getting the book. We knew, so the, well, we and bought it right and he sold out. So we got book, lucky. Yeah. We got the book right away. That was pretty cool. And I got, I had, I got it in free. And, and Robobus got it in for free. Because if it was 12 and under, you got it for free. You get this kid pass. That's cool. Powercon yeah. 2022. Yeah. <laughs> we went to it. Oh, look at Shot of our pickups. So. Oh, okay. Robobus, he's going to open that real quick. Okay. Uh, I'll do it on the chair. Okay. Well, we got to, um, we won't make it too long of a video, you know. I know. So hurry up and we'll get them open. Okay. You want to open this. them? Yep. Okay. Why not? I'm just showing the stuff we got. Okay, I'm opening it. Okay, row of us. I'll get. I've watched shot of him. videos all the time. So here we go. Got this. One, two, three. Where do you want to show them? Four. Just right here. Okay. We got this card. And this is the pack he picked up. Robobus has a lot of Pokemon. His first graded one. You get any ones that you know that, that you like? Ooh, I think I like. Oh, look what I got! Oh, nice. I got a VX, and I got these two. These two are the rare ones. Okay. These ones are just regular cards. So, gotcha. Good. You know, yep. I made a good yep. profit. <laughs> I put this with my first graded card. And you know, that was pretty fun. We had a good time, everyone was nice to us. Right? You know, people, when we were walking with the box, everyone looked. Because they thought, they thought that we had this. Maybe, but everyone thing. loved our box. Eh? 
Everyone was trying to check it out. Like, we showed us. Dan Larson actually took a picture of it. Yeah, that's right. He he signed it right there, and Dan Larson took a picture of it with his with his phone, his signature, which I thought was kind of cool. So don't, this don't, is like one of our holy grails. Don't put the camera at the TV. <laughs> I won't. Well, should we wrap it up, RoboBus? Is a quick pickup video, and then maybe our next video we're gonna open some of these. That, this might be yep. at the hotel. We're opening these to be at the hotel. Yep. And it's gonna be cool. So this was fun. And I'll uh, see you guys next time.